Hey plant gang, this silvery plant right here with the little purple blooms on it is Nepeta ex Faucinii, or cat mint, Nepeta, Nepeta, however you want to say it. Uh, people do say it a little bit differently. Uh, but this is a low growing, heavily blooming, uh, full sun perennial. Now, uh, the blooms have faded. They bloomed earlier in the spring, uh, around the end of April into May, and they could really use a cutback right now. If we were to go in here at the beginning of July even and give this a nice cutback, we would be rewarded with a new set of blooms on this plant. Loves to be in good drainage in full sun, low growing plant. Uh, one of the most popular ones is called Walker's Low. Um, that's a very popular variety. Great for pollinators, uh, great for the edges of a perennial border, a great plant to know with silvery foliage that's also quite quite fragrant as well, almost kind of a menthol-y, uh, minty smell to it, then you should know it when you smell it. So Nepeta or Nepeta X, this is in the Lamaceae family. It has opposite oblong, very coarsely serrate margins on the edge of the leaves. Quite silvery as well, beautiful purple flowers uh, in the early spring, but they do continue to bloom throughout the entire growing season. 18 to 36 inches high with a variable spread. Kind of an erect habit that kind of then spills over. Hardy from zones three through eight. Not a lot of disease and insect problems. Loves well-drained soil. Quite adaptable though, and really loves full sun. Here's a landscape tip. Cut back old blooms after first flowering to promote second flush use in the perennial border, herb garden, or naturalized settings.